All right, you're putting up with Doc T, and today we're putting up with changes in our water feature, and especially with the hostas. So I've got this water feature that was in the house when we moved in, and uh, <laughs> while uh, it always faced toward the main view of it was from the, the street, and that just never made sense. The reason it's here is actually to to hide the well. I don't know if you can see that in there. So. It's been going through major changes ever since we moved in and I decided this year that we were going to reorient it So we took some of those pavers and moved them from Along these sections to sort of reorient it Towards the the driveway area and so that we could see it from where we sit down and Have our coffee or whatever and so the hostas I planted in here five years ago and they're just doing awesome and so when we made this change what used to be the front over there we added some bricks and of course there's no hostas in there so we're going to move some hostas in there so we picked one hosta here that uh actually they all sort of need divided apparently uh but we picked one from there and uh, we did it in a way that we wouldn't be able to see the hole from where we sit and so we took one hosta out of there and we've created i think it's six holes along this edge and what we did is i put took that one hosta and i came in and i divided it into six clumps and i had to cut through that root to to do that so it's just dividing hostas it's, it's how it works and uh so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take those six bunches of hostas. I'm going to plant them in these holes. And so that in, well, we'll have hostas this year, but it takes about three years after you transplant before they really start to, to look good. And hopefully in five years, it'll look kind of like it does in the front. So uh, you're putting up with Doc T. And today we're putting up with changes in my garden. <laughs> 